Hey guys, just want to do a little update for you. It's so like I said, I was going to put these guys in bigger enclosures, and I did. My Brocky Palma Vagons is up there on the wall there. Got him a pretty good size enclosure just because I won't have to transfer him for a while. He can molt like three or four times and still be good in there, probably. And then my, I got all my arboreals. And these tall enclosures with little, I got little pieces of bark or logs in there. Got them outside of my firewood pile. But don't worry, I washed them off real good and then put them in the microwave for like five minutes each. My seven post Armenia and this nice tall one. Probably won't be able to see him, but he's like right on the side of the branch. He likes that. It's kind of blended in with the wood. And my two Togo Starburst baboons, I got them in these vials. You guys weren't kidding when they web a lot. Well, I literally just put them in there like two hours ago and you can see the webs right there. I was going to put them in the same size vials, but I didn't have two of the same size. It's okay though. This one's taller and, a little, and this one's a little wider right there. So I do a little update for you. I got coconut fiber and vermiculite and all of them. So, yeah, looks like they like those a lot. Put the these uh, starbursts, they got pretty good, they're really small, like less than half an inch, but they like those and they'll be able to molt two or three times or m more or something before I'll have to transfer them again. So, same with this guy, he'll be in there for a while. Well, just thought I'd give you a little update. I want, I want everybody to comment lots. So tell me what, what you think of my new enclosures on these arboreals, because it's the first time I've had any arboreals. So I don't have much experience, but I've just, uh, just been, I just uh, got these uh, ideas with sticks um, with, from other people on YouTube there are boil enclosures. I'm gonna know what you think. Well there you go. Uh, I'm gonna cut this one off. Thanks for watching. Bye.